This month is Human Trafficking Awareness Month, and a local group is showing a unique way to bring awareness to that issue, that problem, that crime in Palm Beach County. The group of advocates is using red sand to signify no survivor falling through the cracks. A simple, colorful gesture outside the Victim Services Center in Palm Beach County, where Nicole Bishop is the director. If you can look around behind us, you can see the red sand filling in the cracks of the pavement here. And the purpose of that is to draw attention and to get people to ask questions. Back in 2016, nearly 75% of the calls to the National Human Trafficking Hotline in Palm Beach County were related to sex trafficking. Right now, the county ranks third in the state for human trafficking incidents, and Florida ranks third in the nation for human trafficking cases. Oftentimes, um, victims of human trafficking are hidden in plain sight. So it's all around us. It is, um, you know, people that you might interact with on a daily basis at the grocery store. Because victims often walk among us, Bishop and other advocates want you to know the signs of trafficking. Sometimes people have their identity, their driver's license, their passport taken away from them. Um, people that are always accompanied by someone else who are never allowed out into the public alone. Throughout the month of January, there are events all across our area aimed at bringing awareness to stopping human trafficking. We also have a list of resources you can use on our website, WPBF.com, right now. Human trafficking cases have grown considerably over the past six years. The National Human Trafficking Hotline says that in 2015, Florida recorded more than 300 calls from victims or survivors of human trafficking. Just last year, that number skyrocketed to over 1,100 cases. It comes as cases reported in the state have declined during the same time frame. In 2021, the National Human Trafficking Hotline reported more than 1,200 victims involved in those cases, down from 2015 when 1,500 victims were involved in the crime. The hotline says most of the trafficking cases do involve sex work.